Hey, I recently went to the hospital. So in this video, I'm gonna show you just how much of a nerd you can be at a rave, except we're not going to a rave, we're just gonna make things that you can take to a rave uh, because it's LED lights and people on drugs probably will enjoy it. We're gonna be using some RGB LEDs, some printed circuit boards, uh, and we're gonna make a fashion statement. Except it's just gonna be a prototype, so don't get your hopes up. <coughs> yeah, let's talk about the project, segue. All right, so here's the deal. I found this video on YouTube of these really cool RGB shades. Pretty much it's those shutter shades you used to wear in middle school that just have RGB LEDs on the front. And I thought, hey, that looks pretty cool. Let's see if I can find somewhere to buy those. And so I did some Googling and uh, I found this site here where you can buy a pair of these for 130 bucks. So I think I'm just gonna make my own instead. Here I am again, not giving a shit. Uh, so there's gonna be a quick, you know, build montage of uh, me showing you how not to solder. Yeah, then I'm gonna program it, make a bunch of cool lighting patterns, wear them, and secure my virginity. So pretty much the way this is gonna work is I'm going to take these uh, printed circuit board shutter shade glasses. I have a, I have a pack of them right here. Um, on the back, I kind of have some input uh, some input output pads. Can't really see that with the shit. Uh, supply power and a data line to it via Arduino. So yeah, and unfortunately I don't have a solder stencil, so I'm gonna be hand soldering this whole thing. Should be great. Pretty much this is the setup I have going right now. So I got four pins going on right now, three volts, ground, uh, D0, and D2. Pretty much what happens is I got three volts, ground, and a data pin going to the glasses here. This button down here lets you cycle through all the different lighting patterns. So if you hit the button, this is what it does. Some, some falling rainbows, some, uh, fading colors, radiating rainbow, uh, 
twinkling effect. Uh, I don't even know what to call this one. And then uh, this guy. That one took me the longest, but worth it. So you'll notice that it's really just the, uh, the panel, right, with the lights on it. It goes on your face, however, there's uh, nothing to go over the ears, so you really can't wear it. Um, this is really just a prototype, just to see if I could actually uh, program some patterns and get the actual hardware to work. Now, I've got to design some arms to go over the ears so you can actually wear it and get everything that's on this breadboard and on the business card here onto a single board that just, you know, connects to this somehow. Yeah, instead of uh, buying a cheap Chinese knockoff or spending $130, I spent um, $10. The code's on GitHub. Uh, link's in, gonna be in the description. Uh, so if you wanna check out the code that I use to make all the patterns, go for it. All right, if you enjoyed this video, uh, go ahead and uh, hit that like button. Um, follow me on Instagram. Um, follow me on Twitter. Um, subscribe. Leave a comment. Um, also, go check out my previous video about the Marauder. It's pretty cool. Selling it on Tindy. Not these. I'm not selling these on Tindy. Uh, enjoy this nice outro music with me staring at the camera with the glasses on. Oh.